Here comes Peter Cottontail, hopping down the bunny trail. Hippity hoppity, Easter's on its way. Well, Easter has come and gone for another year. And uh, hope you all had a good Easter. And hopefully the Easter Bunny left you lots of goodies. Anyways, uh, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new to my channel or discovering it for the first time, welcome. I really appreciate it taking time out of your day to uh, watch this vlog. So this is a Easter 2024 vlog. And uh, this is my second Easter vlog. I did one last year. And, uh, and if you have a chance to watch it, uh, you can do so after you watch this vlog, of course. And I'm also going to give you a uh, life update, too, as well. Um, I think some change uh, since 2024 started, so. Uh, without further ado, I'm, I'm gonna have to get, show you what I got for Easter. And first things first, um, I got a new Nintendo Switch game. Uh, it's called Princess Peach Showtime. And, uh, I just started it today, and, uh, I've beaten the first few, uh, levels of the game. I'm on my fourth one now. And, uh, I ordered, um, my sister Trish uh, ordered it uh, online at Walmart, and it also came with this, it's a, a, a little bag, a little, little bag there, uh, with the Princess Peach Showtime on there, uh, both on the front and the same on the back. At first, when I looked at it, uh, I thought it was an apron to start off with, but then when I opened it, it was just like, huh? It's a little bag, and I can put, you know, put stuff in, you know, like a carry-on bag wherever I go. Like for, I, in the summertime, I can put sunscreen and uh, sunglasses, you know, you name it, and, you know all that. And of course, uh, I did get some chocolate eggs, and they're all in this container here. Just gonna be stuck in here. So there you go. See, it's all in there. I uh, put them in there tonight, so uh, set them there. No, I'll have some tomorrow. I didn't get a chance to eat some eggs today at all because uh, I was busy preparing uh, Easter celebrations with my family, uh, which we uh, did today. Uh, we had uh, supper instead of dinner because uh, um, my dad went to Easter Sunday morning mass and. And um, my two sisters and their families had Easter Sunday Mass too, as well. And then, uh, and uh, also did some visiting with their significant other's side of the family uh, too, as well. So, so we just had them for supper, and, and uh, it was quite a fun. Uh, anyways, uh, so that's how Easter, my Easter was, and. Uh, time for a life update, and um, of course, the last time uh, I did a vlog was back at the first of the year, uh, once Christmas was done. And since then, um, there's been some uh, some uh, things happening. And uh, first of all, uh, I want to bring a sad report that uh, my cat of seven years, uh, Callie. Uh, has crossed the Rainbow Bridge to uh, Kitty Heaven, and uh, she passed away on January the 4th uh, from cancer. Uh, very tough, tough one to be, but uh, uh, but over Christmas time, uh, Mom, Dad, and I thought, uh, thought Callie was, you know, sick, and uh, and uh, thought she would be getting better, and like we thought it was the flu, or like. You know, like we get at first, at first glance, and and Callie, Callie wasn't eating much, and and uh, she only was drinking and using the litter box, and that was a major concern. And of course, uh, you know, being Christmas time and vets are kind of off during the holidays, uh, we had to monitor Callie, and then uh, she was just going downhill from there, and uh, and then on the Second of January, we made a call to the vet to set an appointment 
to get her put down. And then uh, in the morning of January 4th, uh, Mom and Dad took Callie to the vet, and Callie almost died, almost almost died before she got to the vet. But uh, but uh, the vet uh, uh, just gave her something to ease up, and she died right on her own right there. And uh, the vet revealed to mom to mom and dad that uh, Callie had cancer. So uh, it was a tough blow, and it was heartbreaking. And uh, mom, dad, and I were heartbroken for sure. And so were my nieces and nephews who love Callie every time they come to visit. And even uh, our dog Millie was heartbroken too when uh, when she lost her her uh, very best friend. But, uh, but anyways, uh, a few days later, on uh, January 7th, um, we got ourselves a new cat, and, uh, and uh, we got, we adopted this cat from, uh, from uh, someone who uh, runs a cat adoption agency, and uh, her mom had a cat at her place that may be the perfect perfect fit. So Mom Dad and I uh, rushed up to rush up to Grey Rapids and uh, visited visited uh, visited the home and uh, and we met the met the cat and he he really loved really loved us right off hand so we got him off and then we got him and uh, of course he's uh, in bed now for the night and uh, you'll you'll all get a chance to uh, see the new the new kitty uh, prob probably within the next little bit. <laughs> next time I will do a vlog, uh, we'll get a get a cameo of the cat. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, to know uh, the cat's name is Buddy. Um, the uh, the uh, one was looking after him, uh, named him that way, and uh, I wasn't gonna. We weren't gonna change the name, so buddy, buddy's the name, and uh, and of course, uh, at first we thought he he was uh, eight months old when we got him, and then uh, this past March he be we would be ten months old, but then uh, we had him spayed and neutered at the vet back on uh, March twenty seventh, and the vet revealed that. Uh, the cat is seven months old, so so yeah. Um, have to trace back to when the cat was born, and then go from there. But uh, but anyway, um, this next month, April, he'll be eight months old then, and then it'll be three months since we got him, and he has uh, grown a lot, and uh, he's still in the kitten phase, but. Uh, He'll grow up to get rid of that phase and as he gets a little older. But uh, but uh, he and Millie and Millie are uh, perfect BFFs and uh, they they chase each other around the house, you know, just like Callie did when when she first meet, met with Millie. But uh, but that's just the way it is. Um, but, uh, so that was uh, month of Jan month of January, uh, February. Now I have to apologize in advance because uh, I was supposed to do a Valentine's Day vlog, my very first Valentine's Day vlog. Uh, but unfortunately, I uh, I was sick in bed on Valentine's Day. I was sick in bed for a few days, as a matter of fact, uh, and it all started. Uh, the day before, on uh, Pancake Day, Mardi Gras, uh, my dad was uh, sick in bed uh, for a few days, and then that Tuesday night I started uh, coughing, and uh, you know my throat was starting to get sore. And I was like, "Oh dear!" So before I went to bed that night, I took a Tylenol to see if that would help. And then uh, Valentine's Day morning, uh, Mom had to wake me up because I had to go move the tractor at the shed because uh, they were delivering a, a pallet of uh, bags of uh, 
wood pellet fuel for our wood pellet stove. So I went out and moved the tractor, and uh, and then after I came back in, I was just like, uh, not feeling too good at all. So I was plumped right on the couch, and uh, didn't move an inch. And uh, there and there and then, uh, I was down with the cold, cold and stuff like that. And uh, I was laying on the couch for nearly, the first two days I was on, laying on the couch, and you know, Couches are kind of hard on your back, uh, but uh, didn't, and the cars couldn't eat much, so R and R drink, you know, water and juice and stuff like that. And then, uh, and then the third day, when I, the third day of the sickness, I laid in mom and dad's bed, and that was pretty well much it. And then I started coming around. We started coming around, dad and I, uh, after a few days, and then. Uh, we felt really better, so uh, that was <laughs> that was the worst few days uh, and all that. But uh, and then uh, here we are. We're at the end of March now, and uh, first first part of March uh, wasn't too bad. I mean, and we had March break, uh, or as most of you call it in the U.S., spring break. Uh, didn't do too much there. Uh, but uh, it was mostly R and R for mom, dad, and I, and stuff like that. But uh, and then uh, we had St. Patrick's Day, and then and of course now we have Easter, and that's come and gone. And now we're about to enter the month of April, when uh, hard to say what's going to be on the horizon. But uh, you do know that. Uh, I'll keep you up to date on uh, on my social media of all of my of, uh, of my adventures uh, for the month of April. Now uh, I also uh, uploaded some Easter photos on both my uh, Facebook and uh, X, uh, formerly known as Twitter, and on my Instagram accounts. And I also uh, did a little Easter greeting on my TikTok as well. So it, and beautiful sunset video too for Easter so make sure you check those out and uh, of course uh, speaking of social media uh, make sure to follow the, my social media down below uh, the links are all there for you uh, follow my Facebook uh, X formerly known as Twitter uh, Instagram TikTok I'm also on Pinterest as well so make sure you give those uh, social media sites of mine a visit and get them a like as well and, and stuff like that and also make sure to uh, subscribe to my channel for all the latest uh, videos uh, uh, whenever a new one's available uh, you get a notification give it a like and subscribe and uh, make sure to tell your friends and family too as well so they can uh, follow me follow me on the uh, YouTubers. Well, anyways, uh, that's it for this vlog. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, hopefully you'll come and pay a visit again sometime. And uh, hard to say when I'll be vlogging again. I'll probably be vlogging. Uh, let me see. I might do one for my birthday, but uh, maybe, maybe not. But you can uh, certainly keep an eye out for Canada Day. Um, excuse me for a second. <coughs> excuse me, just sneezing there. Yeah, I might do a birthday vlog. Maybe, maybe not. But uh, if I don't do a birthday vlog, keep an eye out for a Canada Day one. Uh, if I, excuse me, I'm just about to have another sneeze, but... Uh, Yeah. Okay. I'm going to have to quit vlogging now because I'm going to be keep sneezing here. So until next time, folks, uh, again, uh, from, from my family to your family, happy Easter, everybody. Take care.